What's up guys, welcome to the second part of today's double feature. This video is called, Do I Look Dead? Now, I decided to re release uh, Thrifting Thursday's vlog in two parts as a double feature because um, I did a lot of stuff yesterday and I didn't want to have a 45 minute vlog and just have you guys skipping through. I wanted you to actually be able to enjoy them independently. So we have, my wife still thinks I'm overreacting and do I look dead as the double feature. So I think it's a lot of fun to release it in this way. So it's a different day right now, it's Friday, but I wanted to shoot an intro for, you know, the second part of the double feature because having a cold open just didn't seem right to me. So uh, here we are on a baseball field or in a park. You know, this is where we flew the drone a couple of days ago, a couple of vlogs ago. And we're back because I'm going to fly the DJI Avada, but that is not for this double feature. Um, that is just uh, for today's video. So I do want to go ahead and talk about one cool thing, though, before we get started um, on the double feature. And that is I woke up today and I realized I met some monetization requirements on the channel. Now, what has that allowed me to do? That has allowed me to have memberships on the channel, and it has allowed me to have super chats, so when I'm live streaming. So I have three different membership levels that I want you guys to check out. There is Zombie, Ghoul, and Goblin. I'll put those up right here on the screen, and they get you different benefits for the Drusifer channel and the Drusifer universe. Now, especially since a lot of us make no money from uploading these videos so it is a good way to ensure that your favorite creator or creators that you like continue to upload or are able to upload so um, I really plan on over delivering for anybody that is a channel member um, with exclusive content exclusive videos as well as tailored videos uh, exclusive merch and uh, just exclusive live stream uh, throughout the week so not just the writing live streams that we do on Friday nights but live streams while I'm out and about doing my thing whether they're live streaming while vlogging or you know they're live streaming just doing random stuff I'm not talking about the on the way to work live streams I'm talking about something completely different so um, hope you guys are into it check them out and if you have feedback on them let me know down in the comments in that same vein uh, Patreon, right? Did you guys see the new Jack Conte video? I'll link it down in the description. But I have a Patreon page. I just haven't finished setting it up. But Patreon is releasing a lot of cool new features for creators and for people that support creators, right? So I think I'm going to really dive into Patreon and get that page set up for anybody that is more comfortable using that Patreon method. Uh, but there'll be a lot of exclusive content over there as well. So uh, I'll let you guys know when I finish it. But if you create on this platform, you should go check out the new Patreon because it is going to be gnarly the things they're offering their creators. So um, I'm going to go ahead and fly this drone. Enjoy part two of today's double feature. And I'll talk to you guys in just a little bit. See ya. Can't really like read any of these. I wonder how old these are. This is 18, 1855 on this one. Wish I would have brought my selfie stick so I can hold this out and put it on a tripod. I'm just gonna bounce you guys on an angle. On an obelisk. That's where I can get a picture of your shoes at. Don't you steal that from me. I want to get a picture of her shoes. Apparently that's my thing. Don't you steal that idea from me. Like it. Oh, 
What you looking for, Tom? My shoes are nowhere near as cool as yours. It's pretty insane how these are all like knocked over. I mean, they're old and nobody's probably upkeeping it. You know, there's you a weird feather on that knocked over tombstone. <laughs> I'm trying to find the right photo here. I feel like right here, this is the right picture. Right here. With all of these tombstones. That's a big ass dog. It's a big ass dog. It's Cujo over there. Laying down in graveyards. That's apparently the thing. <laughs> I was trying to I was trying to reach this camera. Do I look dead? Not yet. But, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Camera was ready for it. <laughs> oh man. I bet that's a... Oh wow. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I was locked and loaded. It's entrapment. <laughs> Let me get a picture of you. Put your phone down and put your phone away. Where can I stick this? Right here. I don't want this in the background. I want you to go stand right there. Like right here. Because I want like the leaves and stuff in the background. Alright, well come closer because I've got a wide lens on. Come like right here. This grass right here is really nice. So 1855 is what I saw, Tom. I'm sure there's older ones than that out here. This one, 1862, 1917, I guess, is when this person was buried. It smells like Smells like mothballs over here. Woodmen of the world. It's been a carpenter. What is this little one? <clears throat> February 4th, 1858. It's been knocked off. As such is the kingdom of heart, is what it says on the bottom of that. 1867. I want to look at this one over here. Gosh, what is that? 18... 1862, December 12th, born 1824. Philip Senhauer, S-E-N-H-O-U-E-R. 
W E R. Oh man, I'm in a spider web. That makes it a little more, more gnarly. Oh, I'm all up in a spider web. I like how this one's got this vine going up the side of it and how these trees are overhanging all of these on the side. Whoa. Covered in spider web. Covered in spider web. You found snake skin? You taking it home? Haunted snake skin? No, you're throwing it down. Okay. 18. 1855 is still the oldest one I've seen. That one over there was 1862. This one here, 1848. This is the oldest one so far. This is George S H E L, George Shell. I'm having to like trace over it with my fingers because you can't hardly read it. Eighteen ninety-seven. These are just markers right here, right? Or are these actual headstones? Oh, look at this one. I've never noticed this one over here. Little guy's off by himself, Tom. Oh. I need a tripod. So, unpopular opinion. I think it'd be awesome to live right there. There's a house right there at the base of the graveyard. There's actually one over there as well. That's the one where that big-ass Cujo dog was at. And then there's actually one for sale right across the street. That's this weird, like, mid-century modern-looking house. Yeah, they're not the best shoes to be walking up here in the woods. Or the graveyard, whatever. You want to walk down this driveway and take a look at it? I mean, it's for sale. Surely nobody lives there. Is there? Oh, well, maybe people do live there still. I think it's pretty cool. You don't? I mean, Imagine just painting it, right? Like you paint it, it'd be okay. Look, it has it has a double deck on the back. It has one on the bottom, one on the top. Hang on. I guess somebody's still living there. It looks like it sounds like the AC unit's still on. The deck on the top and deck on the bottom. I don't know. I think it'd be cool. You throw some black paint on that. I think it'd be cool. I think you're right, Tom. I think somebody probably is staying there still. 